Federal and state laws seem to cover a lot of the same subject matter. So how do the courts handle it when these laws seem inconsistent or even conflicting? The tragic 2012 case of Vreeland v. Ferrer examines a Florida court's treatment of one such scenario. Danny Ferrer entered into a one-year agreement to lease an airplane from AeroLease of America, Incorporated. One day in January of 2005, the plane crashed, killing its pilot and passenger, Jose Martinez. This was during Ferrer's one-year lease term. John Vreeland, the administrator of Martinez's estate, filed a tort action for wrongful death in trial court against Ferrer and AeroLease. The court found that Ferrer and AeroLease were shielded from liability because of a federal vicarious liability law. Vreeland appealed to the state appellate court trying to invoke state law. The court affirmed the trial court's judgment. Vreeland then petitioned the Florida Supreme Court, and the court agreed to review the case.